Hello everybody, Vicky here from Tales from the Trails. I hope everybody's doing well. And today we've got a video on three different ways to tame wild horses. We have method one, the beginner. Um, essentially you scare the horse. It's called the beginner because everybody does this right at the start. We all learn as we progress through the game. Method two is for the advanced. It is the lasso method. There's no chasing involved. You use your lasso, you know. And then moving forward, we have the pro, the respect method. Respect is earned and it's between you and your horse. So here we go. We are trying the beginner method, the fear method. You scare the horse. It runs. It is uncontrolled. It can go anywhere. Now you've seen this video, we are in Great Plains with this buttermilk buckskin. And it heads off up into a high predatory area, the tall trees. We do catch up with it. We eventually managed to get a rope around its neck because we were close enough. Keep walking forwards and keep calming that horse. And then eventually we will try and mount it. Just jump on there and it books. We count how many books the horse does with us on it. And it is... It's very erratic. Anything can happen. You have no control. So we're going to find this horse again. You can track it. We had a good idea where it was going. There are a lot of bears in this area, so... Yeah, there was that. So we keep calming the horse, but we're chasing it. Horses don't like being chased. But it is a method. So again, we're going to try and mount it. You can see it's got a like a head collar on and a rope already, because we were already trying to catch it. And we're going to, again, when the horse jumps to the left, we're going to use the left stick and move it to the right and try and keep centred keep calming the horse and we finally do get it broken 26 books in total quite a lot but yeah so what we're gonna do is keep petting feeding and brushing the horse and that bonds it you can also throw your saddle on and that'll bond it instantly I'm gonna keep doing it give it a treat because he's a good boy give him a brush And eventually we do get bonding level one. So that is the fear method. And now we're going to try method two, the lasso. We're going to calmly walk up to the horse. Keep calming it. You, you can talk to it prior. Throw that lasso on. Keep calming it as we need to. And when you get close enough, you can mount the horse and jump on its back. Again, if you jump to the, if the horse jumps to the left, use your left stick and move it to the right. So keep centered on its back keep calming it 13 bucks in total a lot more controlled a lot less distance traveled as well which is really good so again as before it is broken but what we're going to do we're going to feed brush and pet it give it lots of loves and then it'll become bonded with us i'm going to keep doing that i mean that one took a lot less time we're not going to chase the animal across the plains you know very common method. I mean, there's nothing wrong with any of the methods, really. We're nearly there. Just keep bond... Well, trying to bond with this horse. And there it is. I'm going to move on to the third method, which I call the pro method. It's respect. We respect this horse, and he will respect us. Carefully and calmly walk up to the horse, keep calming it. You know, we didn't like that. We'll back off. That's fine. We're going to slowly approach again and we're going to pet him. You can actually pet a wild horse. You don't need a lasso there you go. to attempt the capture. We're going to jump on. How many books do we get? Again, if the horse jumps to the right, you move your left stick to the left. You try and keep centred. We've only got 11 books. The horse was a lot more receptive. And I believe in the future, it takes a lot less time for a horse to bond with you if you're kinder to it at the beginning. For method one, we got 26 bucks. Method two, 13, a lot less. And for method three, we got 11. So yeah, this is, it's just information really. There are different ways of doing things. There's nothing wrong with any method you use. Each to their own, go for it. Try some out, you know, try something new out. So yeah, there you go. 
Hope you do like my video in some way, shape or form. Subscribe if you don't already and you like my content, obviously. Hit that like button, share it if you so wish, you know. It all helps, you know, we've been going for a while, like the beginning of the release of the game. A good few years, I guess. So yeah, thank you very much, all the best, and happy trails out there.